that is releasing new information on a three year project mapping out what water storage opportunities we have beneath our feet. As Chief Meteorologist Monica Woods explains, it's a big milestone as we approach the 10th anniversary of California's Sustainable Groundwater Management Act. A vision for storing nearly a billion acre feet of water in California is getting a step closer to reality, thanks to technology creating a clearer picture of what's underground. We were able to collect about 16,000 miles of airborne electromagnetic survey data over the last couple of years, between 2021 and 2023. The project is basically an MRI of groundwater basins. This is shedding light on hidden water pathways to help local agencies understand what they are being asked to manage. It can inform them where's the best place to recharge and expand a recharge basin or build a new one. And so that's really exciting to have this data be put into practice on the ground. 3D mapping is now publicly available on the department's website. The hot colors show where there is sand and gravel below the surface. Cooler colors show where there is silt and clay. Each one requires different methods of recharge. This new big data set is being fed right into the sustainable groundwater management implementation uh, and informing projects and actions on the ground, which is really exciting. Making the invisible more visible in California's groundwater basins. Very cool. I know. Very, very cool. Aren't those pictures Monica's amazing? Monica's geeking out right now. Yeah, I am. <laughs> Bit. But now that we do have this information, what are the next steps realistically? Well, each basin, Alex, is required to submit their plans to make sure that they know how to store that water underground. And can you imagine not knowing how do we get that water underneath there because we can't see what kind of terrain lies beneath the feet. So this really gives them the information to know, do we have to drill wells? Can mm. we just percolate that water? Will it seep naturally? So this gives them the information to move forward. And this could possibly increase our water storage, right? Oh, for sure. I, I think about this, and these numbers are really impressive. We have about 40 to 50 million acre feet, million with an M, on above storage mm -hmm. water. If we are able to get this underground, it can increase that to about 1.3 billion acre feet with a with B. A B. <laughs> yeah. So that's that's a tremendous amount of water that will help our longevity, especially in the face of climate change. All right, Monica, thank you so mm -hmm. much. We appreciate it. You bet.